one other point I wanted to mention is that um, I said that when you use a bigger sample size over here, the, um, the means of the possible samples are closer together and they, and overall they, they better estimate the population mean. And when the sample size is smaller, the means of the possible samples are spread out further away from the population mean overall, and overall the samples are less accurate. This fact is actually called the law of large numbers. Um, the fact that when you use a bigger sample size, um, the standard error gets lower, and the possible samples more accurately estimate the population mean. That's the law of, law of large numbers. In class, I told you that the law of large numbers just says that um, the means of larger samples are closer to each other and also closer to the population mean. And that's what we see here. These, possi these possible samples um, have sample means that are closer to each other and closer to the population mean of 4.12. These possible samples with a smaller sample size um, have have sample means that are spread out further from each other and also further away from the population mean. That's the law of large numbers. Um, larger samples have sample means that are closer to each other and closer to the population mean. Smaller samples have sample means that are further from each other and further from the population mean. So we see the law of large numbers when we look at these two graphs.